Feeling. What's good with you, man? How you feeling, man? Yeah. I'm, I'm a little bit hungover, but I'm 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 helping out the champ, man. Shout out to the champ. Happy birthday to you again, man. Thank you, thank you, man. I'm looking yeah, forward. Man. Turn a fifty, turn a fifty, and look no more beautiful than it does on you, my brother. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Yo, let, let me let me say this, right? So you know I got the wrestling podcast. And yes, and good. um you, you know actually, what I mean on it today at two o'clock, I remember. Huh? You actually asked me to be on the wrestling podcast today at two o'clock, I remember. Yeah, but you can come tomorrow if you're free. Well, are, are you going to New Orleans tomorrow when you go on Saturday? Yeah, I got something to do tomorrow though. All What's right, up? Copy. copy. But um but no, what what I was saying was on the show we said Twerk is Brock Lesnar. And yeah, Paul Heyman. Okay. You know what I mean? Are you familiar with them, or, or do you not really? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I go more Paul Bearer and Undertaker, but same shit. Yeah, same shit. Nah, the reason, you know the reason why I say, all right, so you got to you gotta think, like. Go ahead, Paul... I'm, I'm a, damn, I'm, I'm a better, I'm a better metaphor person when it comes to shit like this. Go ahead, I'm going to let you get yours off. All right. I'm going to get that off, and then we're going to ask the chat which one is better. Go ahead. All right, of course. So with Paul Bearer and the Undertaker, it's like. <laughs> No, 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 no. You're on the Brock Lesnar side. You make your case for the Brock no, Lesnar. No, but I, well, yeah, I know I am. I'm saying Paul Bear was a big character, but he uh -huh. but he wasn't really like a big persona as Paul Heyman. Like Paul Heyman is hated. Okay. Paul Heyman knows you hate him and he's gonna talk his shit knowing you hate him right. to, to right. support his client. You know what I mean? Like he takes on that persona very well. And um I just feel like it correlates with you because a lot of people for a while you know what I mean? Like Paul Heyman, like even right now, he's not with Brock Lesnar. He's with um Oh yeah, you really are on your Undertaker and Paul Bear shit. The, no, My bad, light, somebody called. The, the lights went out. I, I see you making a strong case for Undertaker by doing that. But, <laughs> yeah. but but what I'm saying is that it's like no matter what Paul Heyman does, people just never look at him as a good guy, even if he's not I mean like so his even right now he's with Roman Reigns and the in the Usos and he's still a hill, so they just and Brock Lesnar is a good guy, so I just feel like that persona fits you because they he knows they don't like him and he don't give a fuck. He's still gonna talk crazy. He's still gonna not me, and no matter what happens with his client, he's supporting his client a million percent, and that's you. Now, I mean, great loyalty, so that's why I went with it. That, that was a very good argument, man. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, you, yeah. you surprised me, man. You surprised. That was, that was a really good argument, um, and now I see what you meant because it I go I go Paul Bearer and Undertaker because at the end of the day the Undertaker's the show. Like Twerk is the show. Yeah. I admit, don't get fucked up, but Twerk is the show. We go out all the time and people, you know, oh shit, there's New Jersey Twerk. It it happens to me once once every six months. Oh shit, that's the Mark from Champion. Like, you know what I mean? So but I look at it with Twerk being the Undertaker in wrestling was damn near unstoppable. Yeah. The only time I Boss was when, you know, he he fucked up. Some shit happened. You know what I mean? It was in the script. Yeah. Um, and it's kind of the same thing with Twerk. Like, I think Twerk can be any battle rapper in the world. Um, th but his biggest opponent is always himself. So that that's what it is. And you know, the other thing is every time, every time people think they got him beat, they think he's dead. Here he comes again, and then he reminds people, "No, nah, this shit ain't over with, dog." This shit ain't over with. Yeah. No, I'm not joking is in the script. I'm saying in wrestling, wrestling is scripted, old dog. So the only time <laughs> he know old dog old dog know that shit is scripted. The movie he was in was scripted too. Oh, okay. yeah, exactly. <laughs> the only time the Undertaker loses is when it's scripted for him to lose. Meaning he had to. Like he fucked up. So anyway. But, nah, yeah, so, but, but, but you know, also to the contrary, like Toby87 said, I'm also comparing it with Twerk as well. Like, you got to remember, um, Twerk, Brock Lesnar is, Brock Lesnar's explosive. Undertaker wasn't oh, that explosive. Undertaker yes, he was. You remember the, uh, I forgot what he used to call it. He stopped doing it very early in his career, but the jaw, he, he would do the arm bar and then walk across the ropes. Nah, he still what? did that. That's the old school. That's technical, Nobody though. Nobody did that. That's technical though, bro. That's not really explosive. Brock is like come through, slam you, yeah. throw you in the ring, pick you up in the air. Even the F five is explosive. Like nigga, he's spinning you around, you being flat yeah. on your face. And what yeah. I'm saying is why I said you Paul Heyman is because sometimes your voice is louder than Twerks. Sometimes yeah, Paul Heyman like is louder than Brock Lesnar. 
Brock Lesnar's more so, yo, I'm here. I mean, he, I, I think they even do the same head shit like this. Yeah. Know what yeah. I mean? But Brock Lesnar's just coming for wreck. Paul Heyman right. is the nigga that's going to sell the fight. He's going. Right. Now, I mean, you know how hard it was to get Torque to come up here for that nasty he, eight minutes? Nope. He came up, but I'm saying uh, he wild calm. Even with you, it's a lot of a conversation because he's just right. there to do the job. Like, you the one right. that does the dirty he's work. I'm not going to tell Jerry West that Jerry West really has no business being here. This shit is, when you say a favor, it, it he wasn't supposed to be here. Some shit happened. It's like, all right, y'all already gave us some money. We about to just chill and wait for summer madness. But you know what? Everybody likes New Orleans. You ever been in New Orleans? No, I think I once I found out it was I had something to do on you Friday. But now that I found out it's on Sunday, I think I might pull up. I you got to oh, hold up. I, I I don't ask you for shit. I really don't. I pop up. I get ideas from you. I talk business with you, but I don't ask you for nothing. It's my birthday weekend, dog. Can you pull up? There you uh, go. Saturday or Sunday. Because I only feel Monday night. No, 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 no. I'm going to pull up Saturday and Sunday we activate it. All right. It's lit. Y'all yeah. heard it here first. Um, But, yeah, at the end of the day, man, shout out to Jerry West, man. Like, you know, Twerk ain't going to say it. And I get it. I, I, I probably have motivated people a little more with the shit talking that I do. Because it just is what it is, man. I, yeah. I believe. I believe in Twerk. I believe in his abilities. Um, I know where he's at preparation-wise for this battle. So I, I know what's about to happen, and and I can't wait. And and you know what's funny? I'm actually happy that it's an app event. I really am. Why? Because if you're not there, when, when, when that thing happens, because something is going to happen, when that thing happens, Twitter's going to go crazy, and everybody's going to have their own speculations. But it's only those true supporters, those people who either have the app or were in the building, that's going to actually know what happened. And that shit going to be... I'm trying to tell you, man. Shout out shout out to Battle Rap, man. I really enjoy this sport, man. I do. I, I enjoy it. Well, y'all heard it first. Something now, something is going to happen this Sunday, man. Man, listen. I, twerk this is, is twerk. why he's Paul Heyman, y'all. Twerk is twerk. So... Twerk will be there. Twerk will have his rounds. And and I believe, like, I know how it goes. People are going to say, oh, oh, everybody's going to chant 3-0 in the building. Then people are, on Twitter are going to say, I can't believe he got 30. Then the battle's going to drop, and they're going to say, what were y'all talking about? Piper Boy going to put up a tweet. This ain't what y'all said. And everybody's going to dicky. And the next thing you know, people are going to be like, oh, no, it's, that battle hella debatable, just like the Snake Eyes battle. We've been here before. Mm. Twerk is the overwhelming favorite. So that's what's gonna happen. But the people that were in there, they they're gonna be treated to something special. And yes, I am not bringing any merch because uh, I don't have. Actually, I might. Now that I think about it. Now that I think about it because I got I gotta bring uh, some some other shit down there. Uh, not props, of course, but uh, I gotta bring some other stuff down there. But yeah. Um. So let me ask you this, right? Was you? Because it's right after I said you was Paul Heyman. You then proceeded to cut like a wrestling promo. So was that the promo or were you telling the truth? You feel like Jerry West has no business being in there with twerk? Um, I'll say this. Let me not say it. Because I like Jerry West as a person. But let me tell you a very short story. Okay. That same show the champion that Jerry West was on in 2019. He was talking shit. I called twerk. You know, they had a little exchange. Uh, the episode is on champion. I'll send you the link if you want to watch it on here. You know, get you an extra hour. Um <laughs> I, bro, I, I know how to. You say, yo, pull up. Yep. Send in my email as soon as we hang up. Yeah, I did an hour on DNA show today. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, Jerry West is dope. But Jerry West was supposed to get me a, a MacBook Pro. Yeah, I mean, we know what Jerry West do. <laughs> I never got my MacBook Pro. From that point on, Jerry West is a piece of shit. And, um, you know, it just is what it is. But in all seriousness, no. I mean, let's be honest. Jerry West should be battling twerk in 2022 as a favor or on some rookies versus vet shit, even though they came in at the same time, because uh, twerk is, is, is a much bigger star, but twerk has fucked up so well, much. Well, hold hold on, bro. Go ahead. You said rookies, ver yo, tw yo, anyway, you're talking kind of crazy right now. I'm just saying, man. I'm, I'm Jerry, just saying, you're talking Jerry West very twerk, crazy right the same now. Amount of time. They've been around the same amount of time. They have. All right. You know what? Fuck that. Now I'm putting you on the spot. Hey, DNA, 
Mm -hmm. Why is it? And, and see, this is the thing. You done said it in battles. I was at the Mickey Fax battle. Okay, that was me. Why is it? So we know you talked to Beasley and Smack and Chico and all. We know you talked to the powers that be. You probably talked to Derez on a regular basis. Why is I it? Actually, that I actually, I actually only have a. I don't speak to Derez actually. Uh, but go uh, ahead. That's all right. You talked to Smack, Chico, and Beasley, so that's fine. Absolutely. That's good, that's good enough. Why is it that every Jerry West trailer has the exact same clip? I don't why? know. Why? Because because Beasley's because Beasley's, yes, yes, Beasley's lazy. No, you know why? You know why? Beasley's lazy, nigga. Go ahead. Go ahead, say it. Say it. I don't it. know. Yes, you do know. I don't, because Beasley's lazy. If a lazy. motherfucker can only quote one line from you all the time, what that mean? Bro, but we can't say that. Because, because... What does it mean? What it mean? What it mean, did I? And boy, listen, listen. You're not gonna get me caught up in anything. <laughs> uh, Just because bullet. they're not posting other clips from him, that don't mean he don't got other lines, my nigga. Bullet, like, I can't no, like, ain't no sugar in this shit. That was fire. Give but me he, another one. Give me another one. You saying and that I will put in the You're a historian. Yeah. Okay. One of them ones, too. Don't just quote some random shit. One of them ones that was like, that was like, get smacked the fuck out of here. One, one of them. One of them. Oh, shit. Mm, that shit that he did with Danny Myers and drugs was crazy. Versus what, 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 what did he do? When he had like three of them and he said, yo, it's three of us. The whole first round he had against Glue Easy. You could take any one of them clips. The shit that smacked okay. was crazy. Don't asking, do that. You can't, man. Don't do I'm, that, Amor. Don't do that. He got, he got some so, shit. I mean, DNA I, don't support Jerry West. DNA know Jerry West is about to go in there, do his best, and get smoked. That's what that's what's about to happen. DNA know it, but DNA from New York, so he trying not to. No, you know, listen, yo, listen. I'm I'm one hundred. I'm always going to tell the truth. I have twerk winning based on. You know what I mean? I don't think Torque is the guy you take on the comeback. But I'm still not going to say Jerry West don't got quotables. I'm not going to say Jerry West is no chance he can win. You know what I mean? I'm going to keep it 100. Like, I, doodle, I, if I was still a gambling man, I would put my money on Torque. But I'm not going to count out Jerry either because Jerry, you know what I mean? I've seen him pull off miracles, and he do have lines. Now, you're, you're saying what you're supposed to say. Yeah, I'm talking my shit. Let me let me give y'all some quotables too, just just so that y'all understand. It. I'm just having fun with this, man. It's it's all entertainment, man. Battle rap is entertainment. I need y'all to understand that. See, but so. now you, but now you fucking up. Now you breaking character in wrestling. No, no, no. That's called I, I'm in looking, wrestling. That's called breaking kayfabe. You're not supposed to do that. Yeah, I'm looking in the I'm looking in the comment section, man. Hey, man, listen. See man. that that that's what fucks up the what, character, man. No, what's it called? Uh, uh, what was the shit? Um. Not the Montreal screw job. What, what was I forgot what they nah, called it's the curtain call. Yeah, it's the, the curtain click. call. When it oh. when, when Shawn Michaels beat D yeah. and then Triple yeah. H and Razor Ramon came out and yeah. they all went to the nah, man. Yeah. yeah. But anyway, um Nova. Uh, at the end of the day, Tubbs did his thing, but I won. You know what I mean? Tubbs did his thing. I ain't gonna lie. Somebody told me Tubbs got crazy, you got crazy, but they had Tubbs. I ain't gonna lie. Somebody said that. Yeah, that's cool. I, I won on the app. You were supposed to act. Oh, they dropped it on the app? Yeah. I'm up on that shit. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna call you as soon as we get off the hair, bro. <laughs> Absolutely. Or anything. But uh one of the things he said in that in that Glue Easy battle, which was I ain't gonna lie, shit was amazing. He was talking about shooting up. Geo seven one three, we not taking you serious. Nigga said, up, man. said like shoot the lamp, shoot the blender, I'm dropping shit out of nowhere, like the or dropping shit niggas don't even care about like the URL at I said, oh my. God, he was kind of wild and glue easy up. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Jerry West is definitely dope. And I think he did his thing um um against Danny Myers at the volume. Um uh, like you know, I, I gotta talk my shit. Jerry West, he's a dope person. Um, but I think you know, at the end of the day, respectfully, there's levels. There's levels to different shit. And you know, I think Jerry West is gonna go in there and be really good. And like everybody is saying, everybody that got twerk losing is saying. Turk going to choke, so he going to lose. The thing is, when Turk don't choke, that's that's when y'all got a problem. That's them them same niggas delete their comments, DNA, or they pull up mm. on their other on their other caffeine channel. I knew he was gonna win. Nah, stay over there. Nah, nah. See, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna hold you. That's the one thing I hate. A fee, a, a fee bands. He thirty. Lou Castro. How many rounds did Lou Castro rap? Take your time and answer that question. Not saying. Not saying that he wouldn't have wild Lou up with his material versus Lou material. But Lou only rapped one round. Of course he 30 them. <laughs> like, Lou was up there 
stinking it up respectfully. That's my guy, but he was up there choking all through his rounds. You're going to lose. You're going to lose if you choke it. It is what it is. And was talking the shit today, ladies and gentlemen. He's hey. available. Yeah, hey, man. I'm definitely available, man. I'm, 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 I don't know, man. I'm hearing some. I'm All right, hearing... so la last question before I let you go and you get out of here. Mm -hmm. Is this a 3 0 or a 2 1? Um, let me see. Hold on. What time is it? Oh, yeah, it's not noon. Yet. Yeah, I can still be, I can still be crazy. Um, yeah, no, I think, I think this is a 30. I do. <laughs> I think there's, like, knowing what I know. And I'm not laughing because you said it's a 30. I'm laughing at how you tried to give it deep thought just to yeah. say what we all thought you was going to say. Because it, it's the thing, right? I'm not going to lie. There, There's one round that I could see people. Yeah, no. I don't know, bro. Yeah, it's, yeah. Yeah, no, this is 30. It's a 30 because, yeah, it's going to get crazy. Yeah, I'm sorry, man. It's, shout out shout out to him, man. It, best case scenario. Best case scenario is, is a 2-1. That's his best case, like where somebody be like, you know, where, where niggas, cause, where niggas be uh, uh, like in a battle when somebody getting dominated in the first round. Oh, he's up one zero. If the other person just keeps their head just barely above water in round two, everybody in battle rap loves to do this. They love to do that because right. when it's two zero, then you already got your winner. So it's like, oh, I don't have to watch the third because he was up two zero. Yeah. Arsenal, Arsenal, and Lou Castro is a fire, fire battle. I had Arch up 2-0 going into the third. Mm. Just what it is. A lot of people won one, and then they debating the third. Y'all can debate the third all y'all want. I think Lou got the third. I had Arch taking the first two. Um, yeah, so it is what it is. Hey, hey Nova, stop, stop giving up the blueprint, man. And it's a big foul. Then you hold a 1,000. Shout out to Hitman. Then you hold a 1,000. Yeah, it's going to be trouble. It's going to be trouble, man. Like, <laughs> Um, but but they, people might try to give one round just because you know it's like oh damn it's two zero going into the third all right we are gonna get Jerry the third. that's what they did with Losa that's what they did with Losa two zero going into the third niggas got twerked two one over Loso. Loso got his ass whooped the third round too but the mic check so I get it yo I listen y'all shout shout out to Ant War aka Paul Heyman he's available. He hey, just man. told us it's a 3 0 for twerk this weekend. He just forced me to come to what New Orleans. What is He's on bullshit. Jerry said he's not ducking no smoke. He's not scared. And he said, uh, take hey, out one or and three he up. Said, and he said, take I, I didn't ask him that, but he said, taking out twerk does wonders for his career. And that's why he took Agreed. the battle. He seemed ready. And Agreed. War. Yeah, I, I, I'll give he him that. He's ready and war. He said Happy something birthday. on prime time. Thank you. Thank you. He said something on prime time yesterday. I was looking. Um, Nigga was like, uh, oh, no, he didn't say that. Jay Black was drunk. Jay Black said uh, it's more pressure on Jerry West than Twerk. And I'm like, you're high. This is Twerk's first battle back on URL since February 5th. Cut it out. Cut it out. People are still saying, oh, we don't want to see Twerk. Oh, he don't deserve to be on here. He need to sit down longer, yada, yada, yada. They still saying that. All the pressure is on Twerk. In my yeah, opinion. Yeah, I disagree with Jay Black. It's on Twitter. Yeah, drinking yesterday, Absolutely. though. I... Okay, he was drinking once in a while. He don't do that too much, so forgive him. Yeah. All right, back. You're looking for pulling up, man, Wall. No, I appreciate you, man. Gotcha. Uh, this Sunday, man, if y'all not, if y'all uh, in the area, man, battling the Bayou, tickets only like $70. Uh, it's going down, man. It's definitely going to be a movie. It's definitely yeah. going to be a movie. Let's make something happen. All right, appreciate you, gang. Got you.